Hey guys, Cassie Guy here. One sec. Back out with another Star Wars Destiny video. We're trying out Zebiota again against Tarkin Trooper Trooper. Which I don't think is as good as um Tarkin Seventh Sister, but we'll see. We'll see. Anyway, sorry to get right into it. I forgot to start recording before we started the match, but we didn't do much otherwise. Training, alright. I don't like that guard very much, but it's not bad. It's not the worst. Certainly not the best, but not the worst. But these rolls are certainly the worst. Boom Ching. Oh, I guess training is good if you have, um, Tarkin. Here, let's pay one. For negotiate. Getting rid of this die to get rid of those two. Said he was playing a casual game, but... I mean, that deck's not bad, so... <laughs> casual... I don't think is the right word for it. You should have two dice. Huh? There you go. I will pitch... Force Illusion. Yeah, thanks. You're welcome. You are very welcome. Some people would be like, what are you doing? Oop. But, this guy knows. This guy knows what's happening. He knows what's shaking bacon. Little folks in a money, that's not bad. But, nothing tarkinable, so. Let's double focus. To this. Aw, I mean, he's a 50-50 chance of rolling damage. One to Tarkin. As soon as we take out Tarkin, we take out the four damage every round. Which is very strong. Anyway, I had some ideas I wanted to share with you this video. <clears throat> One of which is... What is my battlefield? Force opponent to lose a resource. Oh, that's not that great. Anyway, my idea is, um... Ooh, sorry. Oh yeah, my go. Uh, two more to Tarkin. My idea is called the Search for the Best, where I pick five decks, and I play them all X amount of times. Two range of- and- and two under. alright. Let's hidden motive that. Range, damage, and basically whichever one wins the most is what I'm going to call the best deck. And so hopefully we can find out what one of the best decks are, maybe not the best deck, but one of the best decks. And it's an idea that I have. Tell me what you think in the comments below. Hopefully you think it's a good idea, maybe put some deck suggestions. I was gonna do 7th Sister Tarkin for this video, actually. But, um... Hmm. That's a good roll for him. Anyway, I was gonna use 7th Sister Tarkin, but he was using Tarkin, so I was like, eh, I'll use this again. Woo! Quadruple focus. Wowzerinos. We would prefer special, of course, but... Focus certainly ain't bad. Let's pay two. We always have to zoom out when playing cards so that... 
they don't actually accidentally get stuck in our hand. Pay two for that, and second action, we'll roll them in. One, one, one. Perfect. Anyway, the search for the best was my first idea. My other idea, which kind of goes along with it, would be either instead of just playing them all against random decks that I find with people playing on the Ooza I don't like that. Let's double focus to special and plus two. Huh? Yeah. Flanking. Flanking this. All right. I get you. That's smart. Get a resource. Turn this to side number two. Anyway, it's Or I could find a specific someone to play with. They'll make five teams. I'll make five teams. Or it doesn't even have to be five. It's your decision. What is this? If you want to control the battlefield, remove die. That's a good card. He has a threatening deck. Threatening indeed. Let's do... One, two... Three, four. Let's caution. And give him three shields. Yeah, and or we could find make X amount of decks, the two of us, and see how well they work. And see and like do a ladder based system and whatever one is the final winner in the end wins. So if it loses it's out. If it wins, it goes to the next round. Oh, claiming. Um, I'll pass. I don't know why he claimed. Maybe he had some stuff that went with claiming? I don't know. Who am I to judge? Hmm. Not a bad hand. I'm getting my Vibro Cutlasses, but I'm not getting special on him, so I can't get money for the Vibro Cutlass. Tactical Mastery. Alright, I like it. I like it a lot. He doesn't have that many upgrades out, so... That's a pretty fine roll. He rolls in Tarkin. Alright. That's a fine roll as well. Honestly, I'm a wee bit spooked. There's our special. Hopefully, we have time to use it. Bam. We do. That's a that's a strong battlefield heavy deck. If we use the special to get a money, and I mean we want something to Lothcat, but we'll settle for playing Vibro Cutlass and give him a shield. We'll take the the six damage I mean the four damage proudly. Money, he could turk in the monies, or he could double focus to blank and to indirect and do eight damage this round. Ugh. Frightening thought, frightening thought. But pay the four for our good old friend Vibro Cutlass. The cutlass to end all cutlasses is is I think what we're, I and mean, he's double focusing blank into interact, right? No! That's, he's being smarter here. Doing six normal damage and getting money. SMRT, smart. And, anyway. I have two more, ooh, that's a good roll. That's a pretty good roll. Take a money so we can do the four. One, two, three. Sorry. One, two, three, four. 
five, six. Disarm and caution. Pay the one, most definitely. To do four to Tarkin. So my two other ideas were, one, all right, he's claiming, let's pitch, no, you want to get one, let's pitch, never tell me the odds. Reroll, Blanco Franco, pitch, hyperspace, jump, reroll, two, we'll settle for two. Wait, mm. The three damage is not indirect, is not unblockable anymore. So he would basically just heal one and get rid of the shield. Good enough. Wait, can I rotate these? No, I can't. Thought I could. I was like, hey, that's a cool mechanic, but unfortunately, I cannot. Double willpower. Interesting, interesting. Anyway, my two other ideas were, one, to make a video series where I would just... Jeez, he's not rolling those double blanks that he wants, strangely enough. Not strangely enough that he's not rolling the double blanks, it's that he wants the double blanks, but... I understand... Yes, special, because we get special to turn a die, get a money, turn that to special, get another money, play my other Vibro Cutlass. And it's just like double Vibro Cutlass, and then they'll move to Yoda if he dies, and it's just pew pew pew, lots and lots of damage. The grenade, it has five indie sides. That was my other idea. Call indirect damage indie. Keep it short and sweet, the kiss version. Hopefully it catches on. Indy. Rolling in Turkin. Turkin's really good. I, in my opinion, the top three characters in the set are, whoa, Turkin, Yoda, and I don't know who else would be, but definitely Turkin and Yoda. Paying for, for another Vibro Cutlass. They're both redeploy. Jeez, this is going to be a crazy match. Crazy, crazy. It is so crazy. Wow, he's not rolling what he wants. Which I still wish I still had that, um, what's him call it? Never tell me the, uh, ooh, six damage. Enough to kill Tarkin if he doesn't shield up. Sorry. Somebody just arrived. Ooh, what did he do? Play Plastoid Armor? That won't help, I don't think, because... Six. That won't help. One, two, three... I mean, one, two, three, four, five, six. I probably would have made that mistake, too. It's a okay. Thought what was Zeb's dice? Oh, he thought this was Zeb's dice. Oh, oopsie poopsie. Wait, actually, if there was anything better you could have done. Do it. I want a better game. Why not? I... Thanks. Aww. We're friends. She's a symbol showing her die. Yay! Alright. Let's keep this game moving. Let's see. 
Thank you, bro. It's fine. Sorry, wait, as the cool kids do, no problem. Mm, for short. Ah, uh, do 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 do. This is two shields. If we get, yeah, let's get the two shields. Why the heck a doodle do not? One, two, three, four. Jeezers, schmeezers. Um. Let's. Wolfcat? No. Let's hit motive. This. For indirect. Ah, oh, he rolled blank. For once, I actually wanted him to roll damage. One, two, three, four, five, six. You should be exhausted, though. Um, hmm. Pitch roll power. Keep one of the onesies, but reroll the other one. I think. Shield plus two blank. Meh, not the best, but not the worst either. There's the plastoid armor. Yep. P um, yeah, we'll pitch my other willpower. Reroll these two. That's one. Oh, without the plastoid armor. No, even with the plastoid armor, I wouldn't have got him. Pitching to reroll. Alright. That is acceptable. Pitching Lothcat. Rerolling just this, because if it. I have a 50 50 chance to take him out if this rolls any damage at all. But of course it didn't. But of course. Let's steal the four. That's. That's still not something to be complaining about. It's just. Would have preferred to have taken him out. Anyway, for the last idea that I was thinking of, it is, um. Oh, what was it again? Oh, yeah. It, hmm? Okay. It was, uh, just doing a normal video, except with all my useless blabber. Instead of all my useless blabber in the background, you would hear. Like, soothing, relaxing music, so you could watch the amazingness of a Destiny game without all the distractions of the talker's useless, dumb, insulting voice. I'm kidding. I'm a- I have an awesome voice. Mm, best defense. These two. Alright, that's good. That's a good movie. That's a good movie, doodle do. Spotty yellow character, roll all of an opponent's dice, not gonna do that. Do I want to pitch close quarters assault? Not really. I'll pitch Viber Knife. It's not that useful to us anymore. So we re-roll and roll anything but just one one damage. Yep, there's the two damage we needed. Ah, oh, flank. He's got all that mitigates. All the mitigates up in where? Up in here. Why did I pay the one? I'm just playing four speed. It's four speed with Yoda. You know how crazy that gets. You already know. Money and do damage. Ugh, funny. If we negotiate, you would probably remove those two. If we scramble and he rolls two and two, he could take me out. And it's not a high likelihood, but am I willing to take the risk? No. I'll just take a shield. Hmm. And now, if he rolls big damage, then I can scramble. He did roll big damage, just not big enough. So I'll be at one health. And I'll be able to mitigate the other things, if need be. I think, because two, four... Yeah, he can't take me out. Just one special with Yoda is all to- uh, two actions, alright, acceptable. Not preferable, but acceptable. One, two, three, four. I keep forgetting, he does not have 
10 health. He has 12. I still have 3 health left. Oh, wait. Oh, yeah. He still has 2 health left, not 1 health left. I'm a silly goose. Take two actions. First one, pitch close quarters assault. We roll these three. Second one, resolve this to get a shield and turn this to the two damage side. Actually, we probably should have. Huh? What does this do? Resolve one here. Eh. Okay. He's not out, but that's a strong card. Let's take out Tarkin. Zeb's got one more health. If Zeb dies, I'm not sure that Yoda, even with two Vibro Cutlasses, is going to be able to cut it, if you know what I'm saying. But we've got to take that shield, even if he'll take a resource. Anything keeping Zeb alive. That's good enough for me. Hmm, hunting rifle. I like it. I like it a lot. I will claim. Yeah, he knows I'm doing the two indirect to Yoda. Oh. Okay. Great. Awesome. We survived this round still. And we draw three. Hopefully. So here's my plan. We roll on Zeb. We do some damage. Then we hyperspace jump. Then we do it again, except maybe not with the hyperspace jump. Ooh, two, three damages for our money. Yee, scur, So let's pay one to do three to him. So he rolls in, and then I hyperspace jump, and it's basically just a three free damage. Hyperspace jump. Not switching. Not. Switching battlefields. Come on, dice. Get over here. Get over here with your naughty selves. You just draw one. Second chance is perfect, because we'll just overwrite the Viber Knife. And we'll do that right now. Because if he has another tactical mastery, you want to be prepared. I mean, he still certainly has a chance. Huh? Getting mad? I would too. Don't you worry, bro. I would too. Ooh, plus two range damage blank and two indie. Let's roll them in, I guess. We'll just do the two Indy to Yoda. Oh, it's so much easier to say that. And, and we have a money, and that's... Whoa, that's a heck of a lot of damage. Yep, sound the alarm. Figures. I mean, odds are we'll still roll some damage, just on only one damage. Unacceptable! Oh, I'm kidding. I kid, I kid. That shield is off the thing. I'll put it back. Ah, oh, so I'm gonna, my plan is to special into special into special to take two actions to reroll, then do damage. Crazy plot? I know it is. It's quite the crazy. Hmm. Rolling in. Not rolling in. Realizing that one special with Yoda is insane because of force speed. A card that should never have been made. E. I don't quite like that. If I'm being quite honest. 
Let's scramble. Still don't quite like that. It's five damage. The thing is, we'll be at um three health. No, five, one, two. So we heal five, one, two, three, four, five. And he does the other three. Not in the best of places right now. Gonna be on. Oh, yeah. I gotta do the second chance. Get rid of that. Let's special. To get a resource. And turn this to special. Actually, wait, no. We won't get a resource. We'll get a shield. Then special with this. To get a shield and turn this to special. Then special with this to pitch Zeb's rifle, since we're not going to use that anytime soon. Soon, sorry. We need all these dudes. And second action, one damage is all we needed to finish off this trooper. You did well, soldier. You did well. Plus two trooper blanks. <laughs> That's a funny name. Huh? No, he still has training. So this should still be here. That's from that. There's the arrow that we put. Hopefully he didn't even notice it was gone. Waiting. Take your time, bro. Take your time. Whoa, I didn't know you could put cards back like that. The more you know. Thanks again. You know me, just helper Sam. Help in any way you can. Uh, do -do -do. That's a potential 8 damage right there. There's no way we can pass that up. Let's pitch... Negotiate, because that's not useful right now. We roll both of these. Six. That's fine, too. That is fine, oh my. Doubting this. Fine, oh my. Doubted into four. Because it's on a yellow character, it doesn't cost him money. Oh, yeah, he did that already. Okay. I think we got this, but it was looking like he had this um, a little bit back. When he got Zeb down to one health, I was... My teeth were chattering. Four, one, two, three, four. He won't take me out, but... He might have some cool thing that does stuff, so just to 100% assure it, we'll play our other second chance. Second chance is such a ridiculous card. Very sad. Lots of tears. Immortal Zeb. Ha ha ha. Yeah. I would be like, ha ha ha. Zeb is just a crazy. Hmm. One die on Zeb only, but that's fine compared to what we got going on here. Let's just roll on Yoda. Not to rub it in, but to assure the win. Because if we get a money, we shall play, um, never tell me the odds later. What did he do? Oh, wait, huh? Oh, pitching to re-roll those two. All right. Fair enough, fair enough. That's five. One, two, three, four, five. I'll be out and just second chance it again. So, use this. Get a resource. Turn this to special. Use this to get a shield. Turn this to special. Use this to roll on him. And if we don't roll damage, or, yeah, that's enough. GG, bro. GG. 
Very well played game. Hope you like my ideas. Really funny game. Yep. Thanks. Thank you very much. And sorry about mistakes. It's cool. It's cool. See ya. Toodle pip. That's how they say it in olden times. Hope you like my ideas, and I will see you next time.